Hello friends, I'm Pastor Joe. Today is Monday and I have your word for the day. Here's a word for you. Revival. Revival. When I first gave my life to Jesus and became a Christ follower, revival was a calendar event. It was a Sunday night through Wednesday night. It was scheduled speakers. It was guest worship leaders. It was an event. It was a potluck dinner. It was shouting amen. But one thing I noticed, those scheduled calendar revivals seldom brought revival. They seldom brought any real life change. I want you to know something. Revival cannot be scheduled on a calendar. A real, genuine revival begins and ends with God's Word transforming a person into a devoted follower of Jesus. Listen to what David wrote about revival in Psalm 19, verses 7 through 10. Let me read that passage of Scripture to you right now. And you would think I had it prepared, but I didn't. Psalm 19, 7 through 10 says this. The instructions of the Lord are perfect, reviving the soul. The decrees of the Lord are trustworthy, making wise the simple. The commandments of the Lord are right, bringing joy to the heart. The commands of the Lord are clear, giving insight for living. Reverence for the Lord is pure, lasting forever. The laws of the Lord are true, each one is fair. They are more desirable than gold, even the finest gold. They are sweeter than honey, even honey dripping from the comb. If you want to experience genuine revival of your faith in the Lord, read God's Word every day. And don't just read it to check something off the list, but ask God to search your heart and show you what you need to know for that day. Ask Him to search your heart so that you can apply God's Word to your life. If your Bible is dusty, brush it off, pick it up, and invite the Holy Spirit's presence to bring revival as you seek to apply His Word to your life. You hear us say weekend after weekend to grab a copy of God's Word. If you don't have a copy of God's Word, take it home with you because we at Calvary believe if we read God's Word and apply God's Word, He will change our lives. See, His words are sweeter than honey. His, his words are better for you than the keto diet. His words are more, more precious than gold. So seek out His presence through reading and applying God's Word. And I guarantee if you're searching for revival, if you're praying for revival, revival will come to you. If today's Word for the Day has blessed you, apply it, like it, share it, or leave a comment. God bless.